Venice leaders meeting today to discuss the city's future. The topics were wide ranging, but one subject could have a large effect on Venice. ABC 7's Christopher Brantley has the details. There's a lack of, I think, leadership involved in getting some of these things done. For longtime resident Don O'Connell, today's workshop meeting in Venice was nothing he hasn't heard for 20 years. It's the same items they discuss over and over again. One subject was city parks, specifically Wellfield. We obviously do not have the funds to maintain it the way we would like to. So the council discussed the possibility of handing Wellfield Park over to the county in the future. As it stands, the city owns the park, but the county maintains it. But that has been a contentious subject for years as the park has fallen into disrepair. Divided work responsibilities never work, and that's, I think, to come to that conclusion. No decisions were made on Wellfield, but it was an opportunity to discuss an important topic. Outside typical council meetings, city council members are not allowed to have conversation with each other about city business. That's to avoid violating the sunshine law. So you'll notice during their lunchtime, they all sat at different tables. That is unless they have a chaperone. And that's why the city has these meetings, giving city leaders an opportunity to sit around a table and talk about Venice's future. You can sense sometimes there's frustrations if we talk too long on subjects, but it's the only chance that we get to talk to those subjects uh, together. The strategic meeting will go through Friday. The conversation will be a continuation of the topics discussed on Thursday. In Venice, Christopher Brantley, ABC7, your Suncoast News.